I grew up with a dog, so I always thought that I wanted my family to have a dog. They bring, I think, compassion to everyone in the family. They teach you uh, about unconditional love. When we first brought Ginger home, everybody was pretty excited. It went from each kid's arms and mine, and once you brought her home, uh, we actually had her in the kitchen for a little while. We kept her in the kitchen, trying to get used to the surroundings, but the excitement in the house was just unbelievable. So uh, we were pretty happy to have her home and start our life with her. My favorite thing is what we're doing right now, just sitting and cuddling with her. I just love petting her and, and petting a dog just makes you feel so good. When she was younger, I liked to play ball with her, have throw around things and watch her run around and do her little crazy things, but now she's older, so we enjoy the time that she's just cuddling with us. Uh, not having her around is definitely going to be very difficult. And we're all starting to prepare for it. She's part of the family, but to have something in, holding in your hand that is, looks exactly like your dog is pretty exciting, and I know it's something that we're going to love to have in years to come. She's 13 and a half, we hope she's around for a long time, but I definitely, when I first saw it, it was like, wow, this is great. I mean, see the folds in her ears and the way her tail fans and the way she's lying. This is her favorite position. Every time we see her in that position, we feel that she's a puppy still. It is remarkable how they've been able to depict Ginger in this way. Uh, I could never reproduce this by buying something at the store. This is ginger. <laughs>